Oh. Hello, I'm trying again. Linda's back. Are we even in the same? Can they still get me or not? Yeah. <clears throat> I'll just take okay. a minute for the notification to pop up. Okay. I, I still don't see it yet. So we'll... I don't either. I'm wondering if I have to. Okay, I got this. And this means, okay, this should make me live though, correct? Just doing this. That's what mm -hmm. I did last time. Yeah, you're, you're live right now. Okay. See, it says up at the top right corner, it says you're live. Yeah. And I just don't see like on YouTube at all, so. It's my stupid face going, hey. Well, really? It should be, <laughs> it's there. Uh, it's both of us or all of us. Or... It's there. Okay. Is it? Yep. Okay. Because yep. I don't, where do I find it? Here. Go to your oh. YouTube and go okay. to your channel. Okay. Okay. Do that. And um look at oh, you. This is it. I know what I'm doing. You got oh, no, yeah, you I just called you again. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> okay. Uh this. And we go to my channel view channel live events youtube your youtube <laughs> youtube youtube me no good all right i don't okay there's my channel that okay, you know that looks better without my face on it is that Allie's face that I'm seeing there? Yeah, that's me, like waving. That would be the one I want, correct? <laughs> yep. You got it. There we go. I think I got it again. Two for 5,000. You are a pro <laughs> now. See, you got this. <laughs> hey, Listen, you know I, what? I, I, no, I, screw I, that two for 5,000. Two in a row. That's what you I, look at. You find I, the positive. I, two in a row. Good. Thank you guys for staying there because I had to have a mental breakdown. I literally did. Yeehaw. Okay. <laughs> and I'm, now I'm slow again, aren't I? Yeah, let's. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Uh, YouTube is delayed. There we go. Yeah, it is a little I'm delayed. Just, All I'm right. Just, I'm trying to get Hi my. Hi again, audience. everybody. Okay. Hello. It's very delayed. Hi, guys. Thank you very much. Oh, I love you too, Paul. Thank you so much. But I had to have a yeah. mental breakdown. I had a clutch my pearls moment like you did not believe. <laughs> That's all right. Oh, but you yeah. rallied and look at you go. I so what's your next question? Do you have more questions for us or was that just one? Well, geez, I don't know. I kind of like, you know, want to really know how you guys really feel. <laughs> About what? I, I know. I mean, what? It, okay. When you first started um, reading like the transcripts or even talking in groups and stuff, what was your favorite thing to talk about that you, that you really thought you were figuring it out? You know what I mean? And, and you helped figure something out. Let's put it that way. Something that you yourself researched and helped figure out. Day planner. Denise. Man, you got some hard fucking questions for, right. you know. Um, you really think they're hard? Are they? I'm sorry. Okay. Well, I didn't think they're hard because, I mean, I've never things no, that no, I No, no, no. You're fine. I just got to think. Like, that's. Yeah. I don't know. Good question. Good question. Yeah. Because that is a good question, but I couldn't. I don't know. I feel like I've looked at so much and I've always, like, like everybody always says, I can post a link because I know where all the things are. Like, I know how to get to them. I know where to find them, you know. But right. so much, I don't know that I could, I don't know. There's not like, okay, I remember when we first got on Hangouts, you know, back in the day. <laughs> Seems like a really long time oh, ago. Oh, I got an answer, the oh, arrow. What? I found the arrow in Castle, and I remember, I remember that. I'm glad you said back in Hangouts. I do remember that I found that arrow in Castle, and that I could not get hold of Allie fast enough. Allie and JB, I was like stalking them to come into Hangouts to tell them. That was a big, I mean, it wasn't huge, but to me, I was like, oh my God, we're on to something. 
but yeah, let yeah, me tell sorry you. to interrupt, but yeah, that was one no, thing. For not, me. Me. not at all. Talk over me because I'll tell you something. That right no, there sorry. was a big thing for me too because my theory, you know, I had it one time was I think she got shot with a, a bow or an arrow, you know, and yeah. I didn't know Bobby was even doing that. I mean, I haven't even read into that, but the reason why my thought pattern went that way was because of lack of blood. Um, when you shoot something with an arrow and it being placed in there, it stops the blood from, you know, right. flying out. It's like kind of like a wine cork. Yes. You know, with, I don't mean yes. to sound ugly, but that's kind of no. the same thing. Yep, yep. exactly. Hi, Saban Robbie. I love your theme. Uh, music. Hi, Robbie. Oh, I love it. Robbie. You got to do something for me. I like that music. But it, that, because my theory, and I, I think I'd only told a couple people, I think on Discord, or I mean on Hangouts, what I thought about that. And, um, they just listened to me, <laughs> you know, because you know, theorizing, you know what I mean? But uh, it was it, when I found out from you during ma'am that there was an arrow. Do you remember the shock on my face? There really was? Oh, my gosh. Don't tell me it was one of those expanding ones, you know what I mean? Because them are dangerous mm -hmm. and they can go through them. You know what I'm saying? They really do some damage. I used to have, because I, I loved archery, and I had a kit with all of those expanding, I mean, these arrows were dangerous, okay? They're very dangerous. And um, they would kill somebody. They will go through your bones. And they do stop the blood from flowing. So that was my big thing with that, you know, the arrow thing. So we kind of shared that. And that's kind of cool. But I was hung up on the RAV. I got to admit. That was I, part of until it. the conversation about the color of the damn rab that went on for so long, <laughs> I yeah. totally lost it. I mean, I was up to you know somebody else's um kabubu does and uh fed up with it. You know what I mean? I couldn't even hear about green or blue ever again. <laughs> I was like, to me, that car's invisible. <laughs> you know, I just that, but that was always a, something for me was the rap it was yeah, the rap. like with the arrow and mm -hmm. the fix a flat and all that whole yeah. thing like that was another and thing that i that because it could have came in at the angle of that bumper mm -hmm. you know where that hole is and went in there and got the inside part of that tire okay yeah. and that's why the fix a flat comes out okay and that's why the headlight or the tail light or whatever front turn signal would it could fall out and be damaged because of that you know what i mean sure. it could yep. broke right off and just been hung hanging there and they pulled the rest of it off because that does look like that to me in my opinion <laughs> if you look at it it looks like it goes in you know what i mean like there's a in not a you know it's, when you pull something out there's an yeah. entrance not an exit and, is that what you're saying well somebody pulled it out yeah, it's a, right. the, the plastic is bent out this way. Right. So exactly. if you hit something, if you hit something, it's only going to be in. You pull something out of it, you're going to have it coming back at you the other way. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So it kind of mm -hmm. makes sense to me. You know, like an arrow could have stopped it, you know, yeah. stopped the vehicle. Uh, and very likely that could have been Bobby. And mm -hmm. it also could have been an accident. Nobody right. ever thinks of that. They think of murder as murder, somebody stalking somebody and doing that, you know. And it literally could have been her driving by. And uh, here's an example. I moved to New York City and I watch in the news for the very first time. And a lady is on Route 80 going to work and she gets shot in the head and dies from mm -hmm. a bullet was just a spare bullet. You know what I mean? Nobody, somebody was yeah. shooting, didn't think of where it was going to land and it happened to kill this woman. So why couldn't that have happened to Teresa? I mean, I, and it is only a theory and I am only just, you know, kind of putting it out there. Yeah, no. But, I thought about that too. You're the only one. Okay. You know, so I mean, you know, sometimes when I think of these things, I'm like, I oh, don't even mention that because somebody's gonna look at you like you're, rah, you know what I mean? 
she had been up too long. I mean, hey, at the end of the day, all all we have are theories. Seriously, right. that's we, all we right. have. We, right. you know, so uh, talk about it and see. You never know when well, yeah. you know your your idea and somebody else's idea might click and make the difference. You just never yeah. know. Mm -hmm. And with these great redditors that we got on Discord now, and if you guys out there have not joined Cozy mm -hmm. Wrecking Crew Discord, you know, yeah, join. and also join mm -hmm. Paul's Discord. Maybe my mods will put out the link. Oh my gosh, I never thought I'd say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the boss has spoken. Listen, yeah, I got a link. Discord link. Uh, that made me Richards yeah. and Paul's. I think. I like yeah. going in both. Yeah. So one. Thank you. Cause you guys, it, it's a great place to hang out and talk mm -hmm. and, and talk about these kind of theories. We've got rooms for everything you can possibly think of. And then they grow, you know, and uh, I'm going to plug for reporting from my sofa. He has one too. Great. Yeah. He's got making a murderer room. He has the staircase room. He has Ted Bundy. He's got a lot of cases going on and it's fun. You know, he talks yeah. about that. It's a lot of fun. There's so many great people in this community. And, mm -hmm. and, and I, I mean, I just keep getting more blown away by some of the people, you know what I mean? That I've met. And I really feel like a rich person, even though I got a dollar in my pocket, you know what I mean? I really do. I found my niche in something other than a crochet hook and a needle. <laughs> you know what? Nitty needle. <laughs> That's funny. And grab, you know, well, Denise, you can relate to that. We were talking about it earlier. We we're, we we're saying how, you know, hey, we could take a piece of string in a cardboard box and go make something gorgeous, you know, but getting in on yeah. this. I'm down. Your thoughts. Not at all. I mean, I'm thinking about how can I make, you know, um, plastic bottle, um, you know, Christmas trees and recycle things, you know, and make crafts out of them. And then along comes making a murderer and totally turns my whole dang life around. Whoop -a -doo. Like mm -hmm. some tornado came and picked me up. Like, you know, there's no place like home, Dorothy. <laughs> <You know? laughs> I'm not kidding. And I really, for a long time thought like, God, Linda, you're, there's something wrong with you that you think about this all the time that you want to do something, but you don't know what to do. You know, like you, what do I do? What could I right. possibly do to help? Like, maybe people are going to think I, there's nobody out there that's going to think like this. And I'm the only one, you know, what do I do with this? You know? And then you mm -hmm. find a bunch of people. Am I doing this again? Am I, are you losing me? No, you're there. Oh, you're yeah. good. You go girl. Right. Okay. I forgot what I was going to say. No, no I didn't. About finding <laughs> this community. You no, I didn't forget. I was just trying to make you think I did. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Pardon me. But, pardon me. Clutch your pearls then. Anyway. Right. <laughs> but and then I found, you know, my first time ever um, getting into it, I, I was watching the air cozy. He was just going to go on. And I wrote, hi. He goes, hi. hi and I was like, Oh my God. He said, I'd be, Oh, my God. Oh, I can't believe this. They really pay attention. You know what I mean? And I just, I know. I was, I was That's like, what I, I always think about the first time I ever typed anything in Richard's mm -hmm. live. Um, yeah. yeah. And, and I then would, I just started talking to people. And then a couple nights later, Amber posted hangouts and I'm like, oh, yeah. I'll just go in there. And I never, I never got on the call. I would, you know, I chat did. with T via chat. You know what I mean? Like, it was like, you I would know, sound away. And I look at myself now and I'm like, how the fuck yeah. did I get here? Like, yeah. how did this happen? I don't know. Yeah. It just happened. Yeah. And, you know, I mean, and look at the friendships we've developed. You know what I mean? Yeah. Not only from this, but like Paul, he is great. Oh, my gosh. He met. And Saving Robbie. I mean, these guys are such nice people. You know, I mean, they're real and they're nice and they don't mm -hmm. care. You know, like, I mean, come on, Paul said, eat lunch with us. <laughs> right. And if you can eat your sandwich while talking to people uh, all across the world, man, you got props. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it just, I was just like hooked. I really was. I First person I talked to was Travis. And I remember asking him my first question ever was, and I'm going to ask you guys this. What was your first quest, legal question? Think about that for a second. 
My first legal question was, are any of these people accountable for it? Mm -hmm. Crap. Uh, the judge. Culp Is anybody going to do any kind of time for this? Are they... A Nope, they got prosecutional whatever forgiveness. I don't know what they call that. In other words, tied him up in a little bow and said, go sit on a shelf, buddy. You can do whatever you want. Make up all this bullshit that sounds like it came from worse than us. And you're still going to be okay. And you can go around the world and speak about it and still be okay. <laughs> Hello. It makes no sense. Okay. Yeah. And then when I found out that they actually get promoted... Mm -hmm. for this you get a reward for this exactly yeah pride? wait a minute remember when we said that that model that did that you know what had her best yeah. would be her asshole well can you <laughs> sorry you know what i'm saying <laughs> so, uh, you know so really these people are proud of themselves i would be proud to be shining my but bleached asshole to everybody rather than do right. what they did. I would do I, any, I would dip myself in cocoa and go, you know, so I don't care what I, I would dip myself in anything. Picture, let, let them come eat it off me. I don't care. I could do anything, but not <laughs> what they did. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say that. Done, <laughs> when they are un, unforgivable, unspeakable, and and how can they be proud of themselves? How can they how can they face themselves in the mirror every day? And I and I I don't like to wish bad things on people, but you know what? I hope that O'Kelly looks in the mirror and sees Brendan every day. Mm. Yep. And him looking at her going, You don't bother me because I'm strong and you're gonna fail. Because <laughs> that's Brendan, you know, he's strong. He's got hope and he's got, you know, I, I couldn't do it. I, he's I I admire that because I couldn't do it. Yeah, and, and and like I said, at rally, if O'Helly <laughs> happens to come to Manitowoc, the next case you are going to be solving is the Linda Breer killed O'Helly <laughs> case. I am going to hurt him, and then I will walk into Manitowoc and say, "Okay, here's the story. Let me tell you about it when it's at the end." <laughs> I will tell you your narrative. Give me some press conference here. <laughs> you right. know. I mean, isn't Give that me a microphone. Is, isn't that, um, you know, going over, um, what, there's an, I hate this when I can't think of these words. Um, he's like, uh, and unethical is what it means, what he was doing. Um, yeah. You know the word what I'm thinking of? Does anybody, you can type it in that little thing there. <laughs> but um, whatever, you know, I don't understand how, they can't be accountable in Minnesota. They're pretty much there. I think it's state to state. I tell you what, because we just bye bye to that officer that shot that poor woman that called and said our stalker was chasing her and she's running out at him and he shoots her dead. Mm. You know, I mean, they have to go to jail. He went to jail. Bye. See you later. You lost your job. You went to jail. You're going to do time just like any other murderer in the streets. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now that's what they need. And I'm not, I'm not, you know, patting the back of Minnesota because they've done lots of bad shit. Okay. Every state, everywhere you have your good, you have your bad, you have your people who really literally want to help people and go to school and they don't lose their thought of what they want to do. And then you have these people that want to climb and just, they forget, you know, they forget why they went into it. Do you know what I mean? And they lose use all it. humanity. They use, lose all their moral compasses. They lose anything of wanting to help and preserve life. You know, they lose it. They don't care. You know, they figure they're untouchable. You know, I got a shield of, you know, resistance better than rain X on your windshield. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't get it. So anyway, done ranting. No, you're good. So that, good. that were that, that were the really that were the really bad things that bothered me when I first got on, and then of course I didn't have much to go on from that. I just kind of used my typos and uh, shit like that. <laughs> <laughs> Get me by, you know what I mean? Like you know, everybody's got their slick, right? Look at T One; he's the mime, <laughs> you know. And uh, we heard you though, T. Uh, anyway, wow. and then there's me. 
Uh, typo, worse than Manitowoc County, except for I don't get my dates wrong. <laughs> you know, that's important. Don't get your dates wrong. <laughs> okay. Paul, I wish you were going to Raleigh, a rally. I really do. <laughs> oh my gosh. You would be, oh my gosh, clutch my pearls and hold, please. <laughs> okay, Allie, you're dead. <laughs> What, what was my first legal question? Oh, you, yeah. Your first legal question. I don't, I don't remember what my first mm -hmm. legal question was, but I think, or at least early on, it would have been, is there not something that could be done to Kratz for, <clears throat> um, to the get narrative. them to stop talking, to stop mm -hmm. talking now? Because he, he, you know, right. he was all over the place. Yeah. And Were you there when he was uh, doing that at Brendan's um, Umbuck hearing? Where did you see him there? I didn't see Kratz there at that one. Like I was, I was at one of them. I don't remember which one, but I was at the one he wasn't at, or I think I don't even remember. Were you there when <laughs> Schlemmer or whatever is his yeah. name? You were there when yeah. that one was there? Okay. Yeah. I was standing right by him when he was doing his press conference. Okay. If I would have seen Kratz, like it's a good thing I didn't, but if I would have right. seen Kratz, I would have said something, but you would have seen me on the cameras. Right. Like well, but that's okay. what I wanted to know. Like why, what can be done? Is, can something be done to make him stop spreading lies? Like in his book and every, like on every radio show or, or interview he can get a hold of where he controls the narrative. But did you oh, slightly nice. see he slightly changes his stuff in each one of them? You know what I mean? He he does change his own narrative in, in slight ways. Right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And I mean, with all the bad he did, you know, with the pill popping and being high on pills during the murder trial and you know, the sexting and abusing victims, you know, and things like that. Um you know, you think he would be able to, or he would have to be accountable for that because that is not his job. You know, um, he should have been um, prosecuted, I think. And um, like Ripper was saying during ma'am, he's been in touch with some of these people. And if somebody's out there that he did that to come forward, <laughs> because the more people that come forward on him, the bigger chances of him having to be accountable for his actions. Mm -hmm. I don't know about, you know, his job <laughs> that he did not do very well and did not pass the bar exam for. Okay. And he went to skip school. I don't mm -hmm. care. Um, you know, he might've went to that school, but I don't think you were um, all engaged. When it came to the, um, you know, that part where you're a lawyer and you got some morals, he skipped the whole season there <laughs> or whole, you know, whole time i don't believe he I yeah he, he didn't do well in his ethics class that's it right. that's it thank you very much thank you ethics and you know i think they um another thing they should do is maybe check these people psychologically after so long you know dealing with things and the pressures of their jobs and you know the pressure to do bad things is probably very strong you know, like, especially for the lowers, you know, like the regular police officers or the regular sheriffs that just want to do their, you know, eight hours or 10 hours or whatever they do, you know, and they're really not out there to do anything wrong. Get sucked into this thing. You know, I, I'm always fascinated that everybody always says that it could take, you know, all these people to do this. No, mm -hmm. two, three, you know, big wigs and the rest are just going to follow. Because they are not going to go against their command, you know? Agree, disagree. Well, they're Man, not, they're, they're taught to follow orders, period. Right. That, that's so, it. They're taught to follow orders. Right. <coughs> Excuse me. And when people go into public service, of everybody that goes into public service does so because they want to help. They want to benefit their community. Correct. What they don't think about growing up wanting to be in public service service is the politics involved. Who who's 
who's scratching each other's ass, who's sucking each mm -hmm. other's dick. They don't think about that stuff. So when you finally get into, let's say, a police force, you know, you right. don't just because you're superior is on the clock he's probably still answering to somebody who's retired 10 years ago which we can say in this instance for sure so the politics of law the politics of public service is what screws up the whole system right i agree but i didn't know there was so much politics <laughs> you know yeah. what i mean yeah i just didn't I, and Allie. What about you? No, Denise. Yeah. I know. I she she already said it. No, I already right. said it. Okay. Well, now come up with something else. Oh, I got a couple more hard questions. Would you like them? Let me see. <laughs> oh, what you got, Ellie? Especially, Ellie. I'm not trying to call you out in anything, but you have talked to some pretty big names, and we won't have to say them that are involved in this case. How did you start doing that? Was it email? Did you? Um, did they reach out to you through when you went to rally, um, or showed up at any of these, or, you know, I mean, for me, um, Eric Cozy is like, you know, the big wig for me, you know, because that's who I watched and faithfully watched. And because of his, uh, reading of the documents, not, not putting out things, um, like if if the newspaper ad said Kratz has press conference, it's not gonna say Kratz found a body with a press conference. You know, <laughs> there's no additives there. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm I'm kind of going stretching a little bit, but so that's why I liked it. So with you, you're the same way, and Denise, you too. You you believe in following the documents and and going at facts. So how did you meet these key players? Kind of, you know, like. I know you've talked about Kirby before, so I don't mind saying his name, but I don't, I'm not gonna say nobody else, but how did you meet him, Allie? Um, wow. Okay. So. Going off. Well, smoke nah, okay. Okay. <laughs> well, like with, with Jim Kirby, I, <clears throat> I did probably what everybody else does when they want to send in a tip. I went to Zellner's <laughs> website <clears throat> and, um, he emailed me. Yeah, he emailed me and he wanted to ask me some questions. And right. he called me. Well, he, he got my phone number and he called me and we had a conversation about the email I sent. And ever since then, I've just been directly emailing him every time I come up with something new that I want to send in. Um, okay. You sent in the the date planner, if you don't mind me saying, right? The, about oh, that. Sure. Oh, yeah. 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 Long, long, long time ago. Uh, we had a, quite a discussion in um, Discord with Jinxie on that last night. You might want to go check it out. I'll never find it. <laughs> oh, yeah. We well, might well, not. But, oh, yeah, but and you just use the search that. option at the top and type in date planner. You'll probably find it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah. I'm going to have my name pop up every freaking all over the place. It, but the first things that come up are the most recent, so you'll be good. Okay. Right. So anyway, go on. Yeah, I'm sorry. sorry. Uh, well, let's see. That that's about it with him. Um, I just I just every now and then he responds to my emails that I send him, and mm -hmm. usually he just says thank you for the tip or or whatever. Um, sometimes he says something else, but you know. So I guess we've created a, a bit of a relationship like he knows who right. i am and right. i know you're not just like some crazy person you know that's like off their rocker you're sensible about what you send in and thoughtful mm -hmm. of it you know and that's right. what that's that's what people need to if you ask me really be mindful of is um they're busy people right and and they are looking at everything and if you're gonna send them some crack ball crap <laughs> don't expect it. don't expect for them to open their arms and say, please come in and tell us your story. You right. know, because even with the best of proof, they're going to check that stuff out themselves. And all you want to do is open a door for them and let them do their own thing. You know what I'm saying? Right. At least that's well, my thing. I, I do I do all the work for him. 
Like right. he, doesn't, he doesn't have to guess at what am, what am I getting at? Like, what, do, what do I think this means? Right. I, I find everything related to whatever it is I'm trying to, to share. And I put it all together, you know, with all screenshots, all videos, all um, links to anything I need to link to him. It's just all right there. And then I explain it, what everything is and what I think it means. And so it's, it's basically, if you just read the email, you'll understand what I'm saying. It's very clear. Um, right. It's not like a big, long narrative of just talking. It's, um, I'm showing my work, basically. I'm showing what it's based on. So I don't know if, if that's, you know, different, but I, I, I think he appreciates that he doesn't have to go find that stuff. You know, well, where is that listed in Casto, you know? stuff like that like i just list it for him yeah uh, let's see with grease back i think i think i first started talking to him on his um on his facebook page like just in comments like i think i left comments and he answered me a couple times mm -hmm. and then i just started like private messaging him and then we started talking back and forth and then he called me and we had a conversation. Mm -hmm. um, so that, you know, that just, that progressed over, you know, three years. So it, right. it wasn't quick. It wasn't like that. Uh, well, I, I got, I just got a friend request from him. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he's, he's a nice, he's a nice enough guy. As long as you, His voice drives me nuts. <laughs> oh, thanks. Here goes. I, I just, I just talk to people, you know, yeah. like, yeah. well, you have a, you have a nice way of um, calming a storm. Let's say you're gifted that way. You're a very calm thinker and you don't pop off the handle, you know, you're classy. Yeah. Well, I, try, I try not to act crazy. Cause you know, if I come off like with this crazy ass cons conspiracy theory or something, like they're not going to listen to me. They're not going to, they're every time That's they see what I'm saying. Thing, yeah. Every time they see my name, they'll be like, "Oh my God, not her again!" Right? You know, right. I don't right. want that to ever we happen. We all have them so. in our heads. <laughs> yeah. We all have a few of those in our heads, and I can understand that. But like, like you know, when when you are talking to people that are involved like that, you really do have to, you know, you don't want to present yourself as some crackpot, you know, because right. you don't want everybody else out here who's trying to do that too looking that bad you know what i mean we don't want to put off a wrong impression you know we're not trying to um ruin people's lives we're not trying to come up with stuff like kratz did you know we're really seriously trying to figure out who murdered Teresa, and mm -hmm. how can we get the guys out you know i mean i would if if i had one wish in life it would be to go back to mm -hmm. october 31st 2005 and right. sit and watch. I would love to know who did that to Teresa. Right. You know, I think she has the right to peace. I think that the police officers did not have any kind of investigation that even comes close to a murder investigation, let alone a missing persons investigation, because I have been looking at, at what steps uh, they take in that and when does it turn into a murder or homicide investigation um it takes a while okay it takes a little bit longer than uh you know 105 hours or whatever it was for steven to be arrested um and they do things um very meticulously and um to make sure there's nothing going to be wrong you know because they want to really find out who did it to the victim you know, mm -hmm. and now we have three victims and actually a whole lot more than that, because let's count the families. Okay. Um, and then we have, the, you know, crazy clown section who is continuing to live in their cushy little chairs and get their nice paychecks and eat steak dinners and tell other people what to do. And there's nothing happening to them. That is a very sad situation. <laughs> that is a real sad situation as far as I'm concerned. It's pretty bad. 
I don't know. This is a, a case that like I hear a lot of people saying, well, there's this case and this case. And I look into it like Darley. I'm really interested in Darley and the Scott Davis case. Okay. Number two cases that I, I do follow. I, you know, try to find things out about them, you know, and they're similar in a lot of ways. Okay. But there's some that are really investigated. Okay. Like, um, I mean, I, I, I want to say Scott Davis case is kind of investigated in a proper way, but it's the lies from the people that they trust they shouldn't trust that has really caused this guy a lot of problems. Um, I don't know. That's my opinion. But uh, these cases are, how many did that person say there was out there? Um, Casey said, didn't she? 90,000. Yeah, that's a lot. Okay. And we are just, you know, like, rooting for it and reading and all this and other stuff. But there are things, you know, you can petition, you know, your governor and this and that to take a look at certain things. I don't know how far you'll get at it, but I mean, I always hear you guys start with, you know, the politics of it, like you were saying, uh, the politics of it for me, I don't know nothing about politics. You know what I'm saying? But I wouldn't even know how to write to the governor, but that's what I've heard people say, write to the governor or write, write to your senator or this or that. You know what I mean? I don't know. I want to see change. I want to see change for people in the future. Uh, I don't, don't only want them to, you know, be free, but I, I really want to see reform, you know, like EDPA can be <laughs> reformed. It's the biggest mistake. EDPA can be tossed out the damn window. Well, I had an argument with somebody. They said, oh, no, Clinton didn't do that. I said, what? Oh, yeah, well, that's just for, oh, no, 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 no. You don't, you need to read about it because, yeah, they make you think it's just for, you know, get those terrorists and this and that. But it screws anybody, all of us, out of fairness, you know, yeah. out of being able to present a case and it takes things away from you and, and, and you know, just... It, I can't even put into words what I think about it. You know, I get kind of screwed up with that stuff, but there's so many changes that I never, ever, ever in my life. And I'm 57 years old, ever thought of, I never thought of this stuff that I think of and read about and all that other stuff every day. Now I, I don't, I never did. And people are like, well, who are you? <laughs> who are you now? You know, cause I, talk about it all the time and i talk about things that i had no clue of okay i mean nothing i knew nothing of this stuff i didn't know how the government worked i didn't know how them bills worked i didn't know how appeal at court appellate courts work i knew nothing of it so i got it i always tell everybody eric cozy gave me a, a lawyer's degree <laughs> in six months you know what i'm saying i know more about the lie six months than i probably all my life combined you know what i mean why aren't you saying, I don't like silence. Come on, guys. Don't make me hold this by myself. <laughs> no, you, you're on a roll. I don't want to interrupt. I don't know I'm always saying that. Watching this video that Falcon just posted in Discord. Oh, share it. It's called Guiltathon. <laughs> what? Is he being, I think being it's a joke. I, I think, think it's a joke, too. I, I think it's is. a joke. You know, and I, that's another thing I want to, while I'm on here, I'm going to voice, this is my soapbox and I'm going to stand on it. How's that? No. <laughs> um, I think that there are very respectable, if you want to say, guilters. Okay. Mm -hmm. They got their firm beliefs and a lot of them really just don't read. Okay. They just don't, or they don't care to, they would just rather be argumentative. And that's what they get off on. I'm convinced of that. But Falcon has always been very respectful. You know, and uh, I've seen conversations with you and him, Allie. I've read them and you guys really get into it. You know what I mean? But it's never um, a personal jab or nothing. In fact, mm -hmm. you had him on your channel. Yeah. And I, I invited him to join me for Mammothon. And, and you know, I, unfortunately, it's like on vacation or something like that. So he didn't think he could be able, he would be able to, and he wasn't able to, unfortunately, but I would have loved to have him on. Cause like, I don't know how many people know he made the logos for us. He made some videos for us for Mammothon. So he's like 
He's got he, some good points that he, need to uh, even that he needs to be educated. He is the coolest guilter, if you want to call. I mean, Stacy says he 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 just thinks he's a guilter. <laughs> he's not. He just thinks, yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah, but he, well, he's got his reasons, and at least he's um he's willing to listen without just repeating himself of the same old, same old, you know. I mean, he's got his beliefs and it, he needs proof for it. That's fine. I understand that. You know, when I Maybe. first started, I was like, how did that blood get there? You know, the blood bothered me. It bothers me too. It still bothers me. I don't. It's, it bothers me too. Because but it's not I, for the same reasons. I, Right. I don't. Yeah. I, before, when I first got into it, I was like, well, you know, maybe, I don't know, you know, but no, I do not have one, not one brain cell that thinks either one of them had anything to do with it actually. Yeah. It's still, it's still one of those things. that's like, you know, it's very hard to explain. I mean, obviously if we, as truthers, if we could figure, if we knew exactly who put the blood there we probably know who the killer was but right you now we can't prove that so no it's it's still a question um how long do you think people have been seriously i mean i know eric cozy has been like three years you are been like three years denise how long you've been you've been involved since ma'am one i just never got involved with social media right me too mm -hmm. I I didn't I mean I didn't even I held on to this for like so long. Well, thank you, Mr. Aww. Eric, for making a murder. That's very nice of you. Thank you. That's yes, tomorrow. Um, I, tomorrow? I, yes, it's tomorrow. But okay. I I was a lyrical, I guess you'd say, you know, until that one time when I said something and Mr. Cozy said, "Oh, hi, Linda," and I was like, "Oh my God!" <laughs> <laughs> I really was. That's why rally for me is um, I'm going to be starstruck by all of you guys, Denise, Allie, Pom Pom, everybody. Uh, you know, I really am because I admire you guys. I, you know, you, you've helped me. You've kind of helped me learn a lot and yeah, you're just damn good people. <laughs> you're damn good people. You know, met a lot of damn good people. I don't know. I'm, I'm I'm gonna be shy. I'm gonna be very shy, but that's what I said. You think that so, I'm all this? Well, <laughs> yeah, still starstruck too. Well, let's put it this way. I think I might be out for about two seconds. Yeah, <laughs> it won't last. Then long. I'm gonna go. Hello, guess who I am? And no, <laughs> you'll hear me a block away. Oh, there's Linda down there. <laughs> <clears throat> I can't help it. I gotta keep keep it up. You know what well, I mean? Definitely, like by the end of the four days, we'll all be like, like we've known each other for as long as we have, which is at least five months, if not more. Yeah. At least it's, five yeah. months for all of us. Because like, this is probably <laughs> in December. <coughs> Sometimes. Well, I've, I hate to tell you, I've known all you guys longer than you've known me because I've watched was it, you. Or November, was it November? It was November or December when. We all start hanging out in hangouts. It was November because okay, I thought so. Um, because Christmas, I remember I was drunk once. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember like, that. Oh, I was on that call. <laughs> yeah. I was like, "Oh God, <laughs> I'm on fifteen Jello shots." Hee -hee. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> that sounds. That sounds right. There you go. It was like December. It was like December third or something. When, I, you know what? I could look on my Hangouts thing because I still got the first time I clicked on there that is there. You know what I mean? I could look at the date the first time mm -hmm. I talked, you know, and, you know, there's just so many. of I never in my in a million years ever thought that I would connect with so many people that not only do I have this in common with, but I have a lot of other things in common with. You know what I mean? And then I and I just really am so appreciative of you guys being in my life. I, you know, I really do. All of you, you know, I can't name all of you, but all of you, you know, you've all touched me in some way, you know, it all, every little bit, you know, matters. Yep. Hey, we're all making a difference. You know, some of us are standing on the stage and doing it in a big way. And then there's those ones that are doing a 
in a big way, but they're doing it in a big way. Do you know what I mean? It's like they're just unseen. You know what I mean? Hi, Rhonda. Okay. Hi, Rhonda. So, actually, ah, I, I never even seen how how many people are even looking at my mug. Nine. That's good. Thank you, every one of you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love you. Huh? That's so sweet. I, don't care if just, I just I could carry on conversation with just you guys, you know, just mm -hmm. one person who wants to waste their precious time looking at me is good, <laughs> and I appreciate it. All right, see, that's that's great, huh? That's pretty. That's pretty great, actually. What? Like you know, most of the time I only have like twelve to fifteen at the most, and you know. So that's awesome that people are like, I, they want to see you. Like everybody here. And I'm not subscribers. doing anything like I always do on your channel. I'm being <laughs> totally different. And I'm not doing that. Right, we just got started. There's plenty of time. All I want, I just, I really do want people to kind of take me seriously too. You know, yeah, I am a lot of fun. And I love to make, you know, I love to make people laugh. But I really do want people, you know, when I'm, Oh, that lady was talking about butt bleach. What the hell does she know about a bullet? <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't want them to get confused, you know? <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay. All right. Now, I'm going to ask somebody else. Nobody. Nobody else in here. I can't think of anything else to ask you guys. I asked you the toughest questions I could think of. No, I asked you questions that were really actually in my head. I gotcha. Okay, so now what are we going to talk about? Butt bleach now? <laughs> oh, I hope not. I can't do that again. I, I okay. think that the time we put in last weekend on that was more than enough. Listen, <laughs> I watched I watched it the next day. I just oh, I still laugh about it. Draven came to say oh, hi to you, Linda. Oh, hi, baby. He's giving oh, me all kinds of He's Mr. Snugglepants right now. Oh, he likes me. Oh, you're so cute, big boy. Yes, he never oh. comes to see me. Oh, well, that's great. Making your debut with Linda. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I did feel like a deer in headlights. I still kind of do. <laughs> you're doing great. Yeah. I don't care what you think. It's my own thoughts, you know. All right, well, what do you want to talk about? You're the hostess. I've never been that. Well, I don't think I like that. Uh, let me see. I don't like being a leader. I don't, like, uh, I don't know. I just wanted to, you know, kind of get on here and see, first of all, see if I could do it. And then when I got on here, I wanted to see if I would be able to ask questions that made some kind of logical sense. It sounded a little bit sophisticated. <laughs> <laughs> Not everything we want to, motherfuckers. So rip it out. <laughs> Here we go. Right. Oh, I can't stay serious for too damn long. Can I? <laughs> mm. I'm gonna split a gut. I'm gonna have the, Listen, by the time I meet you guys at rally, I'm gonna have a twelve pack. <laughs> <laughs> my stomach hurt so bad that one day oh my gosh i couldn't even yeah last weekend was a little rough it was hilarious it was it was funny as hell <laughs> when i was editing that video and <laughs> i was dying i couldn't even put it all it took me all damn day because i laughed so fucking hard i couldn't i couldn't focus on what i was trying to do you know, I don't know what I thought was the funniest part is when Ellie said, we are about the most immature group of women. <laughs> uh, yeah. Not over yeah, that. <laughs> and, and the fact that Denise is going, you're reading that with a straight face. There's something wrong with you. I know. I'm like, the first like, line that Russ posted, I'm like, no, I can't. And then Allie's like, oh, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Like, she's all serious. <laughs> she and then she, but then she made that face like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, my God. Oh. I'm like, I'm like an asshole. <laughs> when I saw the... The, the what's what the fuck was that? 
Okay. Yeah, but that was one thing about it. Lead team, yeah. Oh, well, you were watching Miss Ashley so-and-so. And then, you know, then Denise pops off that one. Can you imagine you're a model and the best attribute you have is your asshole? <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh-oh. Yeah. Oh, what? You're losing me again? Don't get strange. Don't Who's saying don't get strange? Oh, okay. We got to be classy again. <laughs> oh, no. Hey, no, I, I'm, I'm serious. I was just talking about, like, the past time. I'm only laughing. <laughs> I'm not starting shit. Oh, whatever. You're lying, Ash. You stirred that pot like no other. Mm-mm. I know I got the cauldron broom. Wee, that's starting that bad boy up. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, I'm kind of, you know, I couldn't have did this without you guys. You know, you're, you like really are the, like, you're the best, man. <laughs> you, you guys are, are the best. best. Thank you. You're the best. Yeah. Okay. Now that we're done sucking up to each other, we all got brown noses. What are we going to talk about? <laughs> I don't know. Come on, Eric Cozy, what you want to talk about? Sling that question over here, man, because I've got an answer. Or if I don't, they do. <laughs> I'm starting to feel a little bit easier. If I'm not, I'm making... I don't know. Jane fired off with a good one last week. She let <laughs> that freak show well, that's down the road. Like, so... We were dedicating the last five minutes to Jane. Right. With, with them. Right, Jane, with them? <laughs> yeah. I love her. I love everybody I've met here. Man, people are so nice, dude. I mean, really, I the the people that I have not got along with, you know, I, I'm not naming names and it doesn't matter. You know, they we can all breathe, continue to breathe in life oh without my God. having to do anything. But your cat is just taking over. This is like, yeah. Um well, that cat is not a small feat, though. I'll tell you what, that sucker like about, you know, fucking big as Eric Cody. <laughs> The fluff tail. Bye. <laughs> Bye now. I'm done abusing you. <laughs> Thank you. How did they enter the keys in the ledger as the victim's keys? That was Air Cozy's question. Who knows that answer? How did they I don't. The key in the ledger. Uh, they enter the key. Uh, they, the they already decided. Who, they knew what it was when they found it. Right. They knew what it was when they put it there. They knew what it was going to be when they put it there. Realistically. Yeah. Well, they well, they I'm, knew what it was before. As soon as they saw it, they knew it was important. Remember, they like as soon as well, I saw that key, I knew it was important. I knew we needed to get you know pictures and document. Blah blah blah. Yeah. Well. Uh, you know, Mr. Alien Cop there, you know, <laughs> aliens would have a better chance. You know? I mean, him and his tinfoil hat there, they, they just wished that key in there. Well, it wasn't there first. It wasn't there. Okay. Well, it wasn't there when you moved the slippers. Uh, it wasn't there when you were first over there looking at that cabinet of Nadria. Or was it not there when you turned your back to look at something and Link came in and threw the key and went, oh, there's a key. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? That did not come out of no dang cupboard. You know, it just is impossible. You, you know, they they must all think we're stupid. I mean, that's what really gets me is they must think that everybody, because uh, we're not a small group of people and we do go all around the world. They must think we're all goddamn blooming idiots that just came down with yesterday's cloud. You know, I don't right. like to be called. But yeah, it's just, just I don't think they're, it, it, they're the state's case makes no sense. And when oh, I, we should hear something Monday, right? I heard the 14th, and then somebody said that that's not the day, but it says it on the website. So I really don't know. I just kind of just wait. I, I stopped paying attention too, so I don't know. I just click on it every day, you know, and see, you know. Well, I can't even say that alien Kacharski. He looks like an overgrown uh, baby Huey. Yeah, he's like a giant <laughs> child. Baby Huey, you remember them cartoons? I yeah, do. Baby Huey. Baby yeah, well, that's what he looks. He looks like baby Huey. <laughs> and then we got old eyebrows. You know, he goes like 
they can go right off his face when he tells a lie. He's like, oh, they caught me. I was really behind that grab when I was doing that. Oh, my gosh. His eyebrows want to get the hell off his lying face. <laughs> I swear. You know? Uh, him. And uh, look. At, oh, gosh. There's a look on Kratz's face that just gets me and I cannot even remember where it is, but it is a look of like, oh no, I'm caught. <laughs> Something, you know, there's faces in that that are priceless. And if a face could tell a thousand words, they would have been in jail. Guilty. <laughs> Guilty. There were, it would be. Yeah, there was a shit ton of keys on that property. It was a salvage yard. They should have a whole bin full of keys. You know? Just like, um, you know, I mean, you run a scrap yard and you're not going to crush a vehicle when you killed the girl. You cleaned up all the blood and left the dust in your own DNA, but you're going to leave that car. And you're going to leave it. Oh, let's cover it up. There's no other right. cars covered up. Let's cover it up. Put it on the with a big-ass beacon on it, you know? Yeah, no, nobody I will see that. I'm surprised there wasn't one of the, like, a big flashing light on top of it. Fucking yeah. fireworks shooting out the tailpipe. I mean, what the fuck? That oh, reminds me. Ridiculous. You ever seen dumbest cops? I mean, come on. You rob a bank and you go in the woods with light up shoes? Hello. <laughs> I see. I forget what you told me about that. That was the funniest shit ever. I this told Wayne, he's like, you can't be serious. Oh, I'm serious. The kids running through the woods with little shoes going beep, 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 beep. Lighting is all. I found it and told Wayne. Wayne didn't believe me. I felt Linda said. If Linda said, it's gospel. Well, not necessarily, but uh, I'd really try if I'm, you know, <laughs> I try to research things. Otherwise, I'll say in my opinion or my thoughts or his uh, occurred to me. <laughs> my one brain cell caught that thing. But I I mean, you know, come on. They just, they all think we're idiots. Ah, I just can't believe it. I mean, well, I guess uh, the the real trick to this is nobody ever thought that I'm making a murderer was right. going to well, do I mean, it. if you think about what we know about that, about Manitowoc and um, Calumet counties now, what we know now, and everything mm -hmm. we hear from the locals is basically you don't, you don't, well, number one, you're never taught to question police anyway. But up there, the locals all seem to be not scared, but they just know you don't question right. them or there's repercussions, you know? Right. So, I, I feel like up there locally, no, even if people thought something different, they couldn't say anything. You know, yeah, they were, they were too scared. Like, because there would have been crazy shit happening to them and they didn't want to go down that road, you know. They're simple people, you know. They like I said, they yeah, you know, and they do their gophers and things We like. hear all these stories now of different things up there that went unsolved and were, you know, shady shit went down. Right. So and nobody ever said anything because nobody wants to have shady shit go down on them. So oh. nobody says a word. I'm just but, real you curious. Know, you know, make how the murder gonna... comes and here we are. Yeah, exactly. Nobody, they did not count on, like Stacy says, how many people, I can't even say it. He, he knows mm -hmm. the numbers, but you know, they didn't count on that. And they're just burying themselves deeper and deeper and deeper. It's like when, you know, when they were deposing some of them people in, yeah. uh, in ma'am first when they were saying well i don't recall saying that or i do not converse in that verbiage right oh yeah she's such an asshole whatever yours man himself said well dna can be fabricated i'm not i'm i don't oh, doubt yeah. that oh that's I dumb don't doubt I do not doubt where that that it was a match, mm -hmm. but where did they get it from? That was a very telling statement. Mm -hmm. A very telling statement, I think. Yeah. And am I losing? I'm losing Chad again. Am That's I? Right. You're doing. I, you came right back. You're good. Okay. Yeah. So you know, I mean, that is a very telling thing. If you. Uh oh. That kind of thing, you know. That's kind of telling. He kind of told on his own people. <laughs> yeah. 
and I think in a roundabout way they've all kind of told on each other but they reel it back in real quick you know yeah. Yeah. which is why so many well, their stories all change just a little bit here and there right do you think that um with this newfound document Um, do you think there's anything they can do about that? Are you they gonna are they gonna take that as a typo on her date, being so far ahead from even testing? Oh, for Cole Hang? Oh, yeah. who the hell knows? I mean, do you, play I don't out. know the le I don't know the legal stuff about it. Oh, but I'm sure they've is, got some cockamamie bullshit answer. Are you waiting in the wings for that? Yeah, because I just yeah, I mean that's. Um, that's a whole nother thing. All this has been going on for 13 years, right? Mm -hmm. oh, going on, going on that or going past that. We're going um, on 14, yeah. And once a month, something very dramatic mm -hmm. is found. Yeah. Once a month, something is found. Yeah. So how many times is the state going to be able to play ping pong with the bouncing of the stories. Do you know what I'm saying? Like flat out, there's no bones. Flat out, the AG lied. Okay. Yeah. Flat out, Calber, uh, <coughs> coffer lady, you know, put a, a, a deviation paper way before the bullet was tested and then used all of it purposely because I don't believe right. that DNA. Yeah, that I do not believe that DNA got tested at all. I don't for a second think that that no, DNA. I, the first time I watched Making a Murder, whenever she said that, I'm like, well, that, that was planned. Like, you don't just accidentally use everything you've got. Bullshit. <laughs> there. I didn't hear you, Denise. Oh, I said you don't accidentally use everything you have. Hey, tease in chat. Oh, hey, funny man. What's up? How you doing? Glad to be here. Hmm. <laughs> Make them laugh, T. Uh, I mean, I'm just wondering with all, I mean, every month something happens. And hmm. it seems that the, that Zellner should Oh, um. There's got to be some kind of uh, rep, uh, whatever you know, accountability or whatever you want to call it, because I can't think of the words because I'm nervous again. Um, that you know, Stellner should be able to go. Hey, look, look at all this, you know, and a reasonable judge will say, "There's some really. This just doesn't make sense. Yeah, none of this is connecting it in, in a dot that goes in the circle that they set." Right. They're being pushed on from uppers, you know, like the, you know, attorney general, and he's right in there, you know, he's the one that's lying to the state to begin with. And we all know he's not going to be in trouble for it. So I guess, I guess there, there's got to be some judge or somebody's got to take the reins or can't, I don't know, the federal get involved or they can't, you know, I don't, I don't, I, that's what bothers me. Why can't something be done with all this stuff they find? Right. Because our legal system is. Oh, I'm asking. Really wanna, Linda wants to know. <laughs> right. I really do. I mean, I just, I don't understand that. In one case to have all these things. I mean, there's yeah. way more than 80 things, you know, I don't think I could even sit down and, you know, pop them off. Like when I asked you guys, what out of the 80 things, you know, you had a hard time answering that, you know, because there are so yeah, many. You want me to pick one? That's hard. Picks out what is the best, or would you think it would be better for the lawyer, for Zellner, to take it all together? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Or just pick out certain things, you know? Like, I mean, she's already put emotion in and then things come out, like, you know, the right. deviation paper and, you know, things like that. So, yeah, but see, Zellner, Zellner doesn't have the, the habit of cherry picking. She's not just going to pick a handful of things. She's going to pick all the things and smack you upside your fucking head with them. 
Yeah. So the more weird. little things that come out, it just adds up and adds up and adds up. So. Yeah. And, you know, a lie is never easy to repeat. You know? Absolutely. The truth is easy to remember because it's the truth. It and comes out without any effort. It's like the tree blowing when the wind, you know, the leaves blowing right. when the wind blows. It just happens, you know. But when yeah. you lie, it, you have to think. I mean, what did you say? When did you say it? Who'd you say it to? Uh, right. You know, what did the extent of this, what had, what was, per, you know, what snowballed after that lie? You know, it's just too much. And, and they are getting pretty sloppy with their stuff. Right. <laughs> but, and they but still the keep talking. I mean, done. Kraft especially. I mean, Fast yeah. Thunder seems to have finally shut up, but he was making the media rounds too, you know. So, and you know, I, know. To say, I think a lot of them, you know, probably won't be around. They, you know, they might be gone and you can't do anything about it, which is bothersome to me because. I know we've got weaker to share with them, Calumet. So, what the hell? He's yeah. not going anywhere. And, you know, and Mr. Old Eyebrows himself, um, he's sitting there saying how he was, you know, um, it stopped him from being, you know, progressive in his work and all this other stuff. And he was, you know, defaced his name and this and that. Look at your record, buddy. You were turned down from that cops, them cops. They didn't even want you. <laughs> they didn't even want you when you first put in your application to be a police officer. You know what I'm saying? So be lucky, <laughs> you know? Yeah. How can you say that, you know? And I'm pretty happy that all the people are, He's not going to win that, that Netflix no, thing. Not. There's no way. I, know, I have some different things about Colburn. I mean, I think he's a doofus. I mean, for real. But I'm <laughs> really starting. I mean, I know he's he hard. lied. He did some things that I'm sure he's not proud of. But I don't necessarily think it was his choice. Right. Uh, I'm really. I think. I think somebody said it in chat the other day. And they put it into a word that I was looking for. That he was their patsy, and I, I really am starting to believe that. He well, that's was what a fall I said. guy, and I that's think I that his lawsuit was like, you know what, I fucking had enough, you know. Oh, I was hoping he would just spell it out. Yeah, <laughs> you know, and during I think that, that lawsuit was like his passive aggressive way of doing that. To be like, right. you yeah. know what, I know what everybody's saying, and I know right. what it looks like, but that's not the fucking truth. Well, so, like, like, the, like the butt call. Sorry, but I kind of think that was kind of done on purpose slightly, you know, yeah. I really do. I really do. I think he kind of thought, well, you know, maybe if I just kind of, then it's not really me saying anything. It was an accident, you know, but right. I feel gay bad about this and th this needs, something needs to be done and he couldn't really spell it, you know, I mean, I, I'd like to think that, I guess, <laughs> you know. Oh, he's a saint. How dare yeah, I? Not a saint, T. That was not what I was saying. Old eyebrows. Uh, come on, watch that when he's going like this and going. He's not a saint, but he's also not a damn. He is not a good liar. That you no. know, his face just tells you what he's like. He just gives himself away. And you know, I was thinking about it. When you watch, um, Ma'am One, mm -hmm. his name is not half as much as Link is named. That's okay? what I said. I've always said it. That Link is he is Link is the only one who is everywhere when things everywhere. are found. Link is and everywhere. Is not. And it's Link. And Link is the one just sitting back letting Colburn become their bitch. And I just I think Link is the one that everybody should really okay. think about. It, that's what I'm saying. And um TikTok man talk, you know, when he was on there, he said, You gotta look at the ones that are silent. But always around. Mm -hmm. and it got me thinking because guess what? Link doesn't say nothing no, about not, nothing, ever. but he's always right there. He was so always there. He's somebody to look at for real. For mm -hmm. real. Yeah, Eric Ozzy, and he believes in that, you know, cupboard there, you know, the what is it, Naughty and the cupboard? <laughs> you climb on through that and you go into that fantasy world there, buddy. That's where the key was held by the guy with the rings. <laughs> Precious. <laughs> They're all crazy. I, I just, I, I'm, they, I guess, um, watching a lot of the redditors, you know, during the mammothon, 
it got me thinking because he said he and I've always really thought it's uh, my theory is it's either Ryan in some way I because he has a day platter that's what that's what sticks in my head with him okay yeah. but I really but Jason Zipper I'm sorry and uh somebody we might not know somebody that's what I always said it could be the fucking mailman like nobody knows that's that's what I'm saying. We'll never know. And that's why us telling all, you know, like what we think and this and that is might maybe it gives us some kind of comfort to think that, you know, this could be solved for her. Maybe for, I should speak for myself. If I can rationalize somebody doing that to her rather than just somebody never ever going to be accountable for it is not yeah. a good thought for me. You know what I mean? Right. I'd like to think somebody will be caught and, you know, and I've always wanted to check and see how many other murders or missing women or burnt bones, because it's not, um, I've, there's several cases in Wisconsin, um, <coughs> has there been that are yeah. unsolved, that are unsolved, that had better investigations. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Where cops really did invest. had an yeah. investigation. There's a right. number. Right. Well, yeah, because they're. I mean, when you look at a, you look at a key and then you look at a rav and you don't ask about the victim or yeah. look or, or still even talk about it on the news as her being missing. All of a sudden she's just dead and My, you don't look. in the car, no more missing person. It's, it's amazing. Yeah. Well, it's also amazing that the rav was in custody on, when was that? The fourth? The third third okay that's like before isn't when when did the mom call that in the third the right mm -hmm. yeah okay. and when she called it in what's it say on that report murder death death, death, death. death on that report and on the one where the car's in custody it says kidnapped yeah and then we got you know <coughs> perfect dna you know tester right She's got all the, you know, she got that stuff down pat. She could never cross to anything bad. You know, she never tested that bullet. I really don't believe that bullet was ever tested. I believe that that was a grown grind swab or whatever or something, you know, from that they had around there. And that was never tested. I, I really don't believe that was tested. How could she know 14 days before she ever tested the damn bullet? That yeah. there was you know she was gonna fuck up. Room? Like this day, I'm not gonna be good at my job. Go ahead and mark that down. <laughs> I would when I before I even talked about any of this. When I was watching it on TV, and I, she was the lab tech, and she's <coughs> on yeah. every five seconds. I thought, wow, oh, no wonder oh, why I was in your hand. Mm -hmm. Huh? Never. Well, how can you? Hell, when in my yeah. nursing classes, we were taught, and this was years ago, in your in your elbow and like away, like never in somebody's face, like her. <laughs> oh, she's stupid. Off so much in that three minute period that she was on right. there, I was like, Man, you that contaminated must be like her baby. nervous tick or something. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Uh, well, I don't care. She wears enough Aquanet in her hair that she just went like this and a flake went down. I'm telling you, that's like me. <laughs> you, she, do not go around her with anything flammable because the girl's going to go up like a bomb. <laughs> right. I just, you know, I, I can kind of, um, no, I can't. I, I can't at all. In fact, that's what I'm uh, saying. Fact, Kat, anybody, that's why I, I can't. Can. Can. I cannot think at all like that. So if somebody was telling me to place somebody in a position where they would be, you know, right. solves the murder. This is where you I need to tell them to keep that bullet up their ass and I would go, I would quit. I don't know what I would do. I don't know what I would do, but I could not do their dirty work. You know what I mean? Yeah, I well, just, see, it's her fault. It's her fault that they had to do this anyway, because right. she saved that. She well, saved she was, what had them exonerated the first time. So she's the reason why they look like dipshits. It's her fault. Did, so she now she has to fix it. She has to make this one stick. So that's what they laid on her, you think, huh? Oh, yeah. I Absolutely, I believe that. Yeah, well, it's yeah, her fault that he got out in 2003. As a woman, 
as a woman, somebody telling me that I let out a murderer and it could have been me or something, you know, well, if you would have never let him out, that poor girl would have never, you know what I mean? Exactly. If you would have, you know, so maybe that could have been a mind. I mean, I try to look well, at. She's the reason why that whole county looked inept. She's the reason why they were being sued. It was her fault from their eyes. It was her fault. Sued because now, mind you, she did good the right meat. thing. Yeah. She did her job and she did her job right. Right. But they were going to make sure that this couldn't happen again. Like using all the DNA that was on the bullet. Poof. There's I no did. more to test. You know, those things are not right. accidents. So if you go back to the beginning and look, right. she's the reason why he was exonerated. She saved that evidence. So now she needs to make sure there's no evidence left to test in the future. Period. I'm sorry, dear. I just heard the less to test in the future. <laughs> oh, yeah. You, you cut out. I don't know if it was on my side or yours. I don't know. Am I, I cutting? Testing, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being like tea. <laughs> All right, like, this. <laughs> like this, huh? What? Read chat. Read chat. Yeah, I I forget. I'm gonna be like Paul. Really sweet. Oh, oh, thank you. I can't do that. I can't look at that and then be on here with people looking at me. <laughs> thank you, you guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> See, now I got all embarrassed. I'm turning red. <laughs> thank you very much. I appreciate it. But I guess I gotta blame you too. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! What? I'm sorry. Oh my gosh! Don't get that going again. Oh my gosh! I go. Where's the ship? <laughs> yep. Oh my gosh. T. <laughs> yeah, I'm Bobby Ross. Can you see my paintings? <laughs> I don't paint. I don't paint what happy trees. What is the one all the way on the right? Well, it would be all the way on your left. What is that? I don't remember seeing that before. Wait right there. Yeah. That's that's just another. What one. colors are those? Green, blue. Oh my god. Okay, I am in love with that. <laughs> I am totally in love with that. Yeah. Just have to tell you. Like, well, this is another one that I was going to bring. I can't take it out. That was another one I was going to give you because it's got purple and it kind of goes with yours. That's right here. That's Julie's. That's yours. I got a really nice one for Stacy. <laughs> okay, whose is that one? The, the the blue and green one? I'm not telling. Whose is it? I'm going to... I can't tell you. <laughs> I'm going to steal it. <laughs> there, oh there. Whoever you are... Dude, we're gonna fight. I, I I just I don't know why I never saw that one before. I love it. That's really pretty. Oh, there's <laughs> another wall in there, and I got boxes of paintings. <laughs> oh my gosh! No, mine is awesome. It's I swear it just reminds me of I don't know. Am I losing you guys? You guys, my thing is going up. Uh oh, it is. It's okay. Again, I'm yes. sorry. No, Maybe I should just no, cut it. No, I didn't cut it. No, I don't want anybody to be, you know, like, okay, oh, God. Or let, it, let it work itself out like it did before. Just relax. It's all good. Yep. Hold, hold, please. Oh, please. Weight, kit, kit net, cat net. I use the different weight balances and water. Oh, Lindsay's calling me now. Oh, yeah, Lindsay, get you. <laughs> Except I'm in here, so I better have some uh, ninjas out there. Although I welcome a troll, come on in. Yeah. I'll ask you, tell her you're pretty. Well, ninjas, ninjas, how about that? Yeah. 
Exactly. <laughs> so it's, it's working out fine. You guys are. Yep. It worked testing. itself out. Testing. Can you hear me? Yep. You're all good. <laughs> Okay. Well, I might not be all good, but as long as they can hear me, I'm fine. <laughs> I got a joke, but I cannot tell you that on air. We'll save that for after wise. It just reminded me. Of that. <laughs> I got two of them. Really good too. <laughs> I can't even tell you, but I'm cracking up thinking about them. Oh my God. That isn't fair, is what it? What kind of bullshit is that? Right? They that that's kind of care. Not, what the hell? That's definitely not fair. That's kind of like, Are you a hungry dog? And I got a nice steak and you can smell only. <laughs> no, it's not for public ears, you know. I, I, I'm sure I would offend some people. <laughs> In fact, I might offend you too when you hit. I doubt it, but I could. I doubt it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, now we got to get my mind ready. <laughs> it's not okay. You done told yourself a joke you never heard before? What? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Whoa, you'll laugh this hard too when you hear it. Oh my oh. God. You fucked up. I know. <clears throat> what do you call me? Hot mess. Hot mess. And I take that with, thank you, I love it. <laughs> I just can't open it. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. Whoa. What the fuck is happening? <clears throat> what? Right. That's what I'm saying. What? I'm laughing in my own world here, okay? <laughs> no, I am not. No. Look, I'm offended saying it, but it's funnier than hell. <laughs> um, green apple. <laughs> All right. Let's see. It's a green apple. Can you type in it in Discord? No, I couldn't even spell the words. <laughs> and anybody who knows me, type Olinda, knows <laughs> I couldn't spell them words. <laughs> That's terrible. I'm I'm sorry, people. I kind of walked in some shit and I'm trying to brush off my boot now. <laughs> Denise. What? Denise, you left. Hello. <laughs> okay, guys. I can't think of anything else to talk about. So. Uh-oh. Where did Ali go? Um, maybe she had to take a walk. I don't know. I don't know. That was weird. Oh, she just left. That's what I said. Where did I go? Uh oh, it's falling apart. Before it no, blows it's not. it's not falling apart. She'll be back. Yeah, she might have. I don't know. All right, Linda, I got a question for you. Okay. What? You ready? How do you um, know when you're out of invisible ink? <laughs> I don't know. You don't see it. I don't know. Like, right. Like, that's a real question. I don't get it either. I don't know. <laughs> When the bottle's empty. <laughs> right. When the bottle's empty, because you'll be liquid, you might not. Well, no, I don't fucking know how. I don't, I don't know either. It's just a question. I don't know. Okay. Well. Oh, I. Here. This is where I found the joke. There is an app you can get on your phone. I'll just tell people so I don't have to say it. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's called um it is called oh it's called did you know that <laughs> now mm -hmm. they got some pretty cool stuff in here it's called did you know that and they got nature and human body <laughs> interesting whatever trolls it looks like gnomes about sex um statistics Strange laws. Here we go. Okay, oh, strange now. laws. I love those. Those okay. are fucking good. Okay. Now that's not even funny. <laughs> I can't even. Yeah, some of this is like just ridiculous. Told you she'd be Hi. back. Hi, where'd you go?
I well, I can't even find anything funny right now. In Italy, it is illegal to make coffins out of anything except for nutshells or wood. That's different. But anyway, this app here has several things on there that was kind of really funny, you know. And you might want to, you know, bring it to a party. <laughs> bring it to a party. Huh? Allie? Allie? Mm. She, she's froze? Like this. She's out of it. Allie? Putting it. Are you frozen too, Denise? Am I on this thing by myself? Because then no, I'm, I can't. I'm I'm here. You're all good. Why isn't Allie talking? I don't know. She's frozen. Okay. Allie, Allie. Where'd you go? That's my gal. She went the wrong runway. Ah, found on a butane lighter. Warning. Flame may cause fire. <laughs> what the hell? Right, act like McDonald's coffee is served hot. The fuck, bro? No shit. Yeah, well, that's because of that suit, you know, uh, when that lady burnt her leg, or she got a million dollars for it falling on her lap. Right, like the dipshit. Yeah, I know it happens, there, Cozy, but why would it have to happen to me? I'm so embarrassed easily. <laughs> Do you believe? No, me? it's fine. Oh, Allie's computer's having an issue. Oh, I'm sorry to hear Just that. Back. Well, I don't know. I'm kind of running out of things to say. And I don't want to make my lives. I don't, I don't. Ellie is the queen of running all night, you know? And yeah. I just really, wanted to, I wanted to see if I could do it. I wanted to see if I could be able to open up and talk, you know, it hasn't been easy because I suffered from anxiety like you wouldn't believe, but you can't tell, can you? <laughs> Not when I can get to laughing. But I really do appreciate everybody who even took five seconds to sit here and watch me. And these guys are entertaining, okay? They know their stuff. And thank you so much for being on here, really. I really appreciate it, Denise. You're I welcome. love you. And thank you, Allie. I know you'll see this later. Oh, computers overheat and keep shutting up. I'm sorry, honey. But thank you so much for coming on my first live. Thank you, Eric Cozy, all my mods, anybody who paid any attention at all to me. You guys have a wonderful Mother's Day and talk to you soon.